emotional intelligence as we know it is basically a person's ability to be aware of their own feelings. They are able to identify their own feelings or their own emotions. And apart from identifying their own feelings and emotions, they are also able to manage those emotions. So they can bring out the best uh, regardless of what they are feeling. But apart from understanding their own feelings, they are also capable of understanding other people's feelings. And they make use of all these kind of information to problem solve and to relate with other people. Empathy is also part of emotional intelligence actually. EQ is very important because it's a part of a child's emotional development. From the psychological point of view, we would like to see a child developing holistically. So that includes their physical development, their cognitive development, and then their social emotional development. And in the world today, and basically in a child's development, it's very necessary for them to be able to relate well with other people. Uh, it reflects their social competence. So basically for children who have good social competence, they, uh, they tend to have good friends and it generally helps them uh, in their later development as well. For children who develop into adults who have high emotional intelligence, they are able to consider the perspective of others without compromising their own perspective. And apart from that, they are also emotionally resilient. Uh, now, when a child is emotionally resilient, they are willing to persevere through challenges. And I think that that's very important for them uh, in every situation and it would definitely be beneficial for them in their work life. I think many times uh, parents put their personal expectations on the child. So be aware of the child's individual interests, individual talent. Be ready to facilitate those potentials instead of putting your own expectation as a parent onto a child. Uh, one of the very relevant or current soft skill that we think is important would be uh, their social thinking skills. So the child's ability to socialize, to relate to other people, and not only that, but to be able to understand other people's perspective. Having been able to uh, gather social thinking skills, a child will be able to work well with other people in a collaborative manner. Uh, they will be able to negotiate through their conflicts instead of avoiding it. They will be able to communicate well.